good morning guys it is 9 15 I was up <laughs> okay no no let's talk about this morning at 4 30 in the morning I went to pee like usual like you know a normal pregnant woman gets up and goes pee in the middle of the night well 10 minutes later the power goes out and it's <laughs> still out at, at my place but I have to be up by 8 to leave the house and my boyfriend who's inside the store right now was supposed to watch my daughter all day but there's no power so uh yeah that <laughs> might as well bring them right because they're gonna be bored with no power so yeah now we are on our way to our destination our hospital is about an hour away and we got a bunch of appointments today so i'm going to vlog as much as i can without looking weird and she hates being in the car that's what she does yeah see no but we're also parked so it's a bit worse it's like she doesn't want to look she doesn't want to look at the camera hi why am i so white oh there you go but yeah just wanted to give a little update on what we're doing Three out of four appointments. Uh, one more appointment. This is the third time I'm doing the stress test. Just because I'm on high high risk pregnancy, but everything looks good. But uh, and that's the baby's heartbeat. So I'm just chilling here by myself. Gotta chill in here for 20 minutes, so yeah. I'm so tired. Still never got any caffeine today. I barely had any sleep because of the no electric, which means my fan and my AC turned off, which meant there was no noise. Which really sucked. I could just pass out. <laughs> but this is my last appointment of the day, and it's almost 1.30. So. Guys, look at this. That is my son's arm. He's flexing. <laughs> what? <laughs> it's so cool. Anyways, I'm doing the ultrasound. Yeah, okay. My hair's a mess. We're done the ultrasound, so I'm all done for today. But isn't that the coolest thing? She's like, oh my God, flexing. Okay, we're all, we're all done now. <laughs> Lexi just had an hour nap. <laughs> Still no coffee. I'm so tired. Or awesome. <laughs> see, that's not bad. That is a decent amount. That is great. Okay, see how it's like almost touching the top? That is okay. That is like a centimeter away. All the ice caps I've been getting lately has been to like that blue line, which is like ridiculous. The blue line. Like look. He said blue. The blue line. The blue line. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna enjoy this coffee now. Look at that, babe. Look are, you, are you gonna enjoy? Oh, oh Denali. <laughs> you should start your own YouTube. Yeah, about YouTube. trucks. I know some people will say that caffeine's kinda like bad for you during pregnancy, but you can have up to 200, 200 milligrams of caffeine during a day during pregnancy and Ooh, before I got pregnant, ever, like in my life, I drank a lot of caffeine. Like I was addicted to Red Bulls for the longest time during high school and everything. Like I would have a Red Bull a day. Well, after I had her, they used to 
hurt my stomach a little bit, so I didn't drink them as much. I switched to coffee. Yeah. I switched to coffee. And I fell in love with iced coffees, so I've been drinking those. And, well, it's just so much easier to take care of a toddler when you have some caffeine in you. And you're not deadly tired. So, yep, yeah, we're about to head home. Woo! Update, we have power now. <laughs> She's excited. <laughs> That means she gets to watch the Wiggles. <laughs> right? Will we watch the Wiggles? The sun is in her face. But we have arrived to our, oh jeez. That's getting really bad. That's bad. To our final destination. Alright guys, we are back home. And yeah, I got this shirt. I got this one and a red shirt last year off of a website, I'm not sure. I love their YouTube channel though, it's my fave. All right guys, since the baby is coming in six days, well, today's Thursday and he's coming out next Wednesday, I just wanna show you guys what I have for the baby prepared and you know, what we're gonna <laughs> use and stuff like that. First things first, we got the bassinet yesterday from my grandmother's. It is super cute. I just put a blanket in there for now, but this is what it looks like. It's just a normal, regular bassinet. It is super... I find it's pretty comfy, like... Like, it's not that hard. We will most likely be taking it off the stand and putting it on the floor beside us because our bed is so low to the ground, and that way I can just pick them up easier after my C-section, but yeah. There's that. We have the rocking chair with the ottoman, but it's over there holding my laptop. But we got this at Walmart for about 200 bucks, I think. And it's pretty comfy. I mean, it rocks good. I'm super excited to use it to rock into sleep or breastfeed or whatnot, you know, middle of the night stuff. We have that. This is his setup for now. We have the older, or the bigger sizes, and this one and this one, and then we have the receiving blankets, the newborn and zero to three month onesies. We have some cloths here, um, smart onesies, a hat, all the sleepers, and more sleepers. So just because we are sharing a room with our son, because we only live in a two bedroom. We have this, I still gotta get the piece, I think it's in my daughter's closet, to make it go higher. Don't, just ignore the wiggles in the background. <laughs> He's making my child happy right now. We have this that was hers, but we're just gonna put a blanket over it. I mean, it doesn't really matter if her son sits in something pink, it's not a big deal. She still likes to sit in it though, so I don't know what she's gonna do when he, when we put him in there. I don't know if she's <laughs> gonna want to sit on him or something, but I mean, she still likes it, so. Yeah, so we have this for to put him down in in the living room if he's just sleeping and I have to do something or whatnot, so. And we do have the crib, but we're not setting it up right now due to not knowing if we're moving yet or if we move in the next few months. We're not sure yet, but he's only gonna go in this at like Three months anyway that is the plan but we have the crib it's just not set up we're gonna use the bassinet till then i also have a whole bunch of bottles from when lexi was little too she used the dr brown bottles i do plan on breastfeeding though so like i have a lot of bottles for you know just in case and i mean in public we won't use the pink ones because that's gonna look whatever we'll probably use those more often um and yeah because i do plan on pretty much breastfeeding like I want him to breastfeed for as long as he can but it's just for night feeds or when daddy has to bring him somewhere well at least I will pump and then put them in those so she grabs these cereal boxes out of the cupboard way over here and then she just goes nuts I mean the lucky charms one is empty 
I'm just waiting for a mess to happen. Hey, look, she loves it over there. Lexi, what are you doing? Hey, Lexi? What are you doing? Hey. So cute. What are you doing? Oh. Whatever makes you happy, child. <laughs> what? What's mommy gonna do with those? <laughs> Baby Cam. Oh, I guess she she's taking over. Get some good footage, okay? You gotta get your hand out of the camera, though. There, look, say hi. Say hi. Oh. Yeah, you got mommy's other phone. Can you say hi? Quick update. Uh, my doctor's appointment looked good. Baby is still headed down uh, on the ultrasound. She didn't do a measuring one. She just did a checkup, just like, those are the kidneys, that's heart, blah, blah, blah. That's like, you know, they tried to get a face picture, but it didn't work. But everything looks good. My blood pressure was good. I didn't get the results from my blood work back yet, but I mean, I'm sure if it's really deep, like if my platelets dropped a lot, well then, I'm sure they would call me, I hope. Or maybe I should call tomorrow, see them, I'm not sure. But, um... Yeah, I just wanted to let you guys know that everything's looking good. I mean, I'm already 36 weeks and four days, and that is just mind-blowing to me. I'm, okay, I'm guessing my baby's going to come out at around seven to seven and a half pounds, just because he is two and a half weeks earlier than 40 weeks, so. But it's just, he looks pretty big on the ultrasound, and me and my boyfriend were like massive babies, like nine almost 10 pounders so my guess is in between seven and eight but I want to hear you guys' guesses on how big my baby will be I was nine pounds ten ounces when I was born and he was like nine pounds six six ounces or something so but think I'm he's coming out at 37 weeks and three days so I mean I'm sure he would have grown a lot more in the last two weeks but just for my safety and but that's okay with me because he's going to be, well, so far he looks super healthy. So, and they said if my water breaks before my scheduled C-section, <laughs> I just go straight to labor and delivery. So, what are you eating? Sorry, don't mind my belly. <laughs> she takes the cereal and now she's eating wheat. Oh my God. All right, supper is almost done. I'm going to be eating here in a sec. <laughs> We're going to the sun, babe. <laughs> Alright guys, I'm going to say goodnight for tonight. Um, I hope you enjoyed the vlog and I hope you click that subscribe button. It was a long day. I am super tired. I'm going to edit this vlog, put it up, and watch Big Brother, and then go to bed. My boyfriend just left for the gym, so it's the perfect time to do this all. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, we have a few video ideas in mind for the next uh, few videos. So, well, we have one in mind for sure that we're going to do in the next few days, and I think it's going to be really funny. So, me and my boyfriend are going to do a video together. So, I won't say what it is, but... I think it'll be hilarious. So, uh, yeah, if you click that subscribe button, you won't miss it. And uh, I hope we won't let you down. <laughs> and comment below how much you think my baby's going to weigh when he's born. And that would be awesome. Because my guess, I think my guess is 7 pounds 
let's say seven pounds. Six ounces, yes, yeah, seven pounds, six ounces. Yeah, I feel like it's gonna be bigger than that, but just in case he's not, well, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna go with that. So yeah. All right, good night guys. Hope you had a great day. And I hope to see you guys in my next vlog or video. Bye.